Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Let's Play Pillars of the Earth. Last time, Philip got nominated as as the as a candidate to be Prior of Kingsbridge, or was it Knightsbridge? Some kind of bridge. I think it is Kingsbridge. Um, and we need to find uh, this book, this letter. Let's look at documents. James spent much time writing in the last ten years. Instead of a prior, he became more of a recluse. That is what you monks do, isn't it? It used to be. That's not in there. Tablet. The handwriting on this tablet is hardly legible. Whoever sheds the blood of man, by man shall his blood be shed. Cain? I think. Did Prior James write this? Let's continue looking. I think, yeah, I think that's Genesis after Cain is. Oh, maybe it's not. I don't know. Francis, I think I found, I found it. a letter. In the Bible? Revelations. The Apocalypse of St. John. Is that him? And they called to the mountains and uh. rocks. Fall on us and hide us from the face of him who is seated on the throne and from the wrath of the Lamb. For the great day of their wrath has come, and who can stand? The Lamb? What was James afraid of? Was it this letter? No, the letter is still sealed. Break the seal. It's only one of them. All right. Letter dated the 18th of December, 1135. Robert of Gloucester, name the day, and we were ready to shed blood in the name of Empress Maud. Oh, I looked into this, by the way. Um, it is Empress Matilda, and she was married to the Holy Roman Emperor, but not at this point. Uh, at this point, she was married to whoever she's married to. Um, who I did look up is the Count of... Oh, it was the Count, Count of Anjou. Um... But she was also commonly known as as Maud, so that's why there's a difference in my memory and what's what's here. Um, I and my bondsmen will ride against Stephen of Blois. We do not start the war, but we shall unleash it. That sounds like starting it. Uh, Stephen himself started it uh, the day he betrayed King Henry's daughter and took her throne. He and those who swore loyalty to him. Bartholomew, Earl of Shiring. Oh, this is it. You found it. The Earl of Shiring is about to start a war. Yes. He's made contact with my own master, Earl Robert of Gloucester. Who is this King Stephen that has taken the throne? A nephew of King Henry. Do you ever think of the day our parents died? Francis, you know I don't like to talk of that. I know. It's just that I think of them all the time. And I've always blamed King Henry. The church suffered under his rule as much as we did in Wales. Philip, you have to show this letter to the Bishop of Kingsbridge. Yeah, yeah, the Bishop? The Bishop of Kingsbridge? Why? I thought this was Kingsbridge. Our late King Henry was opposed to Rome's influence in England. King Stephen, on the other hand, swore to preserve the rights and privileges of the church, and we can help him if you tell the bishop to protect Stephen. Ask about his motives. And it all arguably is treason. You want the bishop to help the new king, King Stephen? I want a king who supports the church. I want these dark times to end. I want to stop the Earl of Shiring from starting a war. He could set the whole of England on fire. My lord, the Earl of Gloucester, can never know what I was doing here. You must not tell the truth about how or where you got this letter. Don't tell anyone I was involved. Okay, okay, I'm glad this isn't a timed one. I, I get to think this through. So, but the king is right. Yeah, what are you loyal to, is the question. Um, without any other information as to exactly as to the individual person, 
yeah, like, supporting Steven is technically treason. Because the king wanted his successor to be his daughter. So, and I'm going to refuse. Because, yeah, this is treason. I will not do it again. Lied? You didn't say a word, even when Remedius insisted. I lied. I told everyone I just wanted to save Prior James's documents. Not mentioning the letter was an act of diplomacy. Uh, I'm not like you. I'm not a diplomat. I'm a simple monk. Who am I to talk to a bishop? I cannot. And will not do this. I understand. I will ride to St. John's and tell your monks you will stay in Kingsbridge until... Oh, it is Kingsbridge. Okay. And then I must find a way to get this letter into the hands of the bishop. Oh, right. Okay. You helped Francis to uncover a conspiracy. Nominated to become prior. Did not agree to meet the bishop. You reported... Brother Marcus the Thief. You gave Brother Paul a hot stone suit this pain. Remedius lost his temper, but he respects us. Yeah, and I found a message in the mill. Okay, so that's the end of chapter... I could have just played another couple of minutes. Ah, oh, well. Maybe I should have done. So that's chapter one of book one done. Chapter two. Jack. Shoot forest. Oh, a boar. Hunt for food. Oh. Can I? Oh, I can't do. Can't do anything there. I'd rather not. I'd rather not. Uh. So what's further along? Is there? Oh. Oh, it's further this way. Where are you? Okay. Is oh, hoof prints. Are you not going to give any information about that? Okay. Okay. Can I use the slingshot with it? I'd rather not. Okay. I can come down he he here. No, okay. Can't interact with it. What can I even interact with then? Hello. I assume we we kill the deer. the side rather than the head. And do I try again? Yeah. There we go. Yes. Yes. Dead dead. My name is Jack. For a long time, it was the only name I had known. I was born and raised in a cave by my mother. We were used to getting by, but that year the winter had been harsh. I was proud to have killed my first deer that day. And while waiting for mother to help me cure it, I decided to practice my reading. The cave. The lord and king of all France. Charles the Great has spent seven long years fighting in Spain. <laughs> he has conquered the highlands and the plain. Uh, Trying to remember. He I don't know why I'm doing that if I'm practicing my reading. Think harder. The Lord and King of all France, 
Charles. So this is Charlemagne. Has spent seven long years fighting. Is this the Book of Roland? He has conquered the highlands and the plain. Yeah, before him, not a single fort remains. Go on. Before him, not a single fort remains. <laughs> Afternoon was approaching fast, and Mother still hadn't returned. Oh, no. So, if I wanted to cure the meat, I had to do it on my own. Else it would all go Is to she waste. she dead? Soon I'll know it all by heart. What have I got? Oh. That's, that's not a thing. Right, okay. Uh, do I know what I need to do? Smoke the meat. Oh, I've got a little castle. How exciting. Oh, the venison. I can't eat it raw. I need to cure it. Meat goes bad fast. Fast. Uh, have I got anything to smoke it with, then? I don't know how to smoke meat. Tools. Do I need them? Inspect Ellen's bow. Ellen and Jack keep a variety of short and long-range weapons in their home. The two lead their lives as outlaws, outside of society and the protection of the law. A bow can serve as an invaluable tool both for hunting and self-protection. Most outlaws were once accused of a crime but failed to appear for judgment. According to the law, their contracts, claims and ownership then fell void. As outlaws have no rights... Anyone can harm them or capture them and turn them in. Thus, many outlaws turn to a new, a life of a new life of hiding and thievery. Uh, and oh, castle! Let's look at the castle. There he is, Charles the Great, the protector of my town. Charlemagne. You're coming with me. Oh. Yeah, Charlemagne. But. How do I smoke this? Please tell me I don't have to burn Charlemagne. One book is in French, the other in Latin. Oh my goodness, how terrible. Right, what else have I even got? I've got nuts, but I can't pick them up. What's that? It's a noise coming from the forest. Right. Can I burn? Do I have to burn? No, I won't abandon. Good. I was slightly. We are fighting side by side now. Okay. Um, I was worried I might have to. So how do I? How do I? How do I? How do I smoke it? Okay. Let's go and investigate. Follow the noise. Oh, that worries me. Okay. This is a baby. Wait, is this is this is this us from the prologue? No. I don't think so. Good. He hasn't seen you. Who is he? A whip. That's what he is. A whip. That means he's someone bad. I told you about people like him, remember? A bailiff. He's a bailiff. No, but just as ugly. He's a Doesn't monk. look like a monk. Oh, so this is Philip brother. Like this one bit. He looks nice though. He's smiling. Listen, cub. I am sorry. I know there's so much you want to know about the world out there, but for now, we must stay hidden. And never trust a man of God. Least of all his compassion. You'll either end up in a monastery or at the gallows. Get down. Easy now, it's just someone little. No need to be afraid. Oh, as an outlaw. Yeah, I can see. I'm going to follow him. 
You go home and wait for me, little cub. Oh, no, I want to look at the, the rag. Look around. Because that makes... Oh no, this is, isn't it? This is... That was a gasp, not the help. Foot. Wanna go home? Yeah, yeah. Maybe we shouldn't have done that. Cause now, well, now the crows are gonna have something to eat, I suppose. Uh oh. Mother? Uh -huh. Can I use the rag to cover her up? Assuming that's the mother from before. Right, okay, so there doesn't look like there's anything else to look at around here. Yeah, because that's the frozen puddle we, we used before. Uh oh. Don't move. We killed the pig thief in Salisbury. We can kill you too. Bloody hell. Where's the baby? Did you eat it? I don't have the baby. Right. What's this? Give it back. What do you want with this? You can't read. Give it back. Oh, leave the boy be, Alfred. Hey, yeah, I thought so. He he took the baby. I saw him take mother's cloak. He's the only one around. Who else would have taken it? Wolves. A monk took it. A monk? Yes, on a horse. Is that true? Where did he go? He should take us there. Leave him alone. He's just a boy. What is your name, boy? Um. No, let's be open. I've been open so far. Jack. Do you live in these woods? May not have been wise. Then you know this place better than us. Please. I don't know why I left. Because you're an idiot. I thought I couldn't take care of him alone, but I cannot leave him to die either. I have to know if he's all right. Will you help us? You're a good lad. I owe you. If you want your silly book back, you better keep your word. Oh. oh, I don't like you. Stealing books. Ooh, we now have a map. For now, I had no choice. The girl was sobbing while her father remained tense but quiet. The boy kept on pushing me, which confused me greatly. I had never been hated before. If I had any plans of getting away, it would be like hunting deer. I had to stay sharp until the others got to be. 